What's up, Internet? Uh, Matt Guff from House.com. Scotty Stank. Matt Siddons. Yo, uh, I first, as we kind of start this little uh, video, I want to give a huge shout out to these two guys. These are the guys that do all the stuff behind the cameras, uh, do the editing, the sound, the lighting, make the studio what it is, and uh, make me look good on the channel. So thank you guys. You guys absolutely rip. Thank okay. you. Word up. So these guys were actually lucky this week. Um, they went up to Lutzen. It, it was like, what, May 2nd and 3rd? Yeah, 3rd yeah. through 5th. Yeah. yeah, yeah, and uh, I wasn't able to go and ride, but they grabbed some of the 2020 Rosinog goods. And this thing, definitely the big brother, the HD heavy yeah. duty version of the Jigsaw, yeah. uh, killer graphic, yeah. killer. Um, basically the same shape from what I understand, except for it has carbon uh, on the inside or ca carbon la laminates basically on the on the top sheet. What do you guys think in, in contrast to the regular gypsum? Got, uh, got it. Yeah. Uh, HD, heavy HD. duty. It's a good way to describe mm -hmm. it. Uh, a little bit stiffer mm -hmm. and definitely more responsive in, in your turns and in your ollies. You got to put a little more into it, but when you do, it'll give give it back too so right. yeah definitely for the more for the rider who's looking to do a little bit more uh and you know maybe hit some bigger jumps than yeah and and That's stuff fine. like that than than your normal uh jib saw yeah right. you know? yeah i mean it seemed like um the it was it's the jib saw but it's kind of more of a hard charger hard charging jib saw right so it'll like you can feel a little bit more confident going off those bigger jumps, mm -hmm. having more stability on the landings. Mm -hmm. um, it's got a bit more stiffness, so it's for that park rider who who right. wants a bit more stiffness in their board, and then obviously you can take to the bigger sides of the mountain too. I, I like the HD version of the Jigsaw uh, because for for anyone who's kind of aging a little bit too, you know, like I gr I grew up riding twin park boards mm -hmm. in the 90s, you know, yeah. like. My heart will always be in freestyle, even though like I do more free riding now. Um, but it's that's a really good board for someone kind of like me, or maybe even a dude a little bit older who still likes popping around, going switch every once in a while, still dabbles in the park, but mm -hmm. likes to go just a little bit faster. Yeah. And even like any like you guys are saying, it's like a good jump board, lots of stability in the landing. Um, for any of those park kids that yeah take it a little bit further. You know, a little yeah. bit more aggressive. Jib, jib saw is, you know, the HD is, is definitely that one. Yeah. I know um, uh, Nick Belbus, like, he's an absolute ripper, rides out of Park City now, from Minnesota originally. Uh, he slays, absolutely slays on the HD. Oh, yeah. Huge jumps, mm -hmm. murders on rails, too. Yeah. That's what's up. Yeah. <laughs> what is, uh, uh, with the jib saw HD, what was your favorite character, uh, character trait about the deck? Well, I kind of like um, the, you know, I like a good strong board that you kind of uh, have to work for, like mm -hmm. use your legs a little bit more. Right. So mm -hmm. I think, yeah, I I liked the responsiveness of it, you know? I don't know, it, it might be, it might wear you out a little quicker, you know what I mean? Right, But uh, right. But it's fun to kind of feel that spring, you know? A mm -hmm. little bit stiffer yeah. of a board. Right. Yeah. Same thing? Um, yeah, I mean, <laughs> it was... I rode this right after I was on the uh, Jibsaw. And mm. For where we were at, the Jibsaw was more my thing. Okay. Just because it was just a bit more playful, which I liked, while still being, you know, medium stiffness. Right. Um, and, yeah, just... Great for Minnesota riding. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, sometimes too in, in soft conditions because the snow moves under you almost so much more. Like a stiffer board kind of doesn't mimic that kind of like it, like you, you want to flex you want to flex the board out, but the yeah. snow will move a little bit more. Yeah, so it almost feels like it's like a knife through mashed potatoes. You know, just mm -hmm. like the snow doesn't push back on the board as much as it could if it was a little bit more firm. Yeah, you know. I kind of, kind of, kind of experienced that. I think at a, 
at the Bank Solomon, I rode that. I rode one of my favorite boards, the Jones flagship, yeah. carbon flagship, uh -huh. but it was too way too stiff of a board really? for 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 the yeah. conditions and the in the terrain choice. So I can okay. I can imagine how you'd, you'd feel that way. Yeah. yeah, and I mean we were, and that was at a at a point where there's plenty of snow being pushed. So I was really looking at my line and trying to maneuver around some of that kind of stuff. Right. Um, and that was really easy on the, on the, uh, jibsaw. the jibsaw. Right. The the HD it just took a little bit more to mm. get edge to edge and and um, yeah.